Purim literally means a congregation. Folklore has it that every year the deities of the neighboring hamlets meet at the Vadakum Nada temple. On that day, the heavenly hosts bring the heavens down on earth, drowning the land and the skies in joyful tumult. Ten temples participate in Thrushur Puram, held in Thrushur, a small town in the northern part of Kerala. For the town of Thrissur, the sleepless nights start even before the Puram. Fairs and exhibitions lend a touch of extra glitter to the ever so mesmerizing Puram colors. The enchanting elephant decor exhibition is a rare one of its kind and draws hordes of visitors every year. The dawn of Puram Day. This is the Thiruvambadi temple. At seven in the morning, a sub-deity, Goddess Yogamaya Devi, starts her journey to the Vadakam Nada temple. Eight other deities from various temples in the surroundings also set out to the Vadakam Nada temple. The final confluence of all the mini Purams from each temple becomes a virtual feast for the eyes and a symphony celestial for the years. The procession from the Thiruvambadi temple stops at the Brahmaswam Madam for certain rituals. From there, the procession moves on to the Vadakum Nada temple with the accompaniment of Panjavadyam, a traditional orchestra. This is the Paramekava temple. By noon, the goddess of this temple sets out to the Vadakum Nada temple. Once the goddess comes out, the kudamatam, or the changing of umbrellas, decked with finery, commences in front of the Paramekava temple. The Ilanitara Melam is one of the central attractions of the Puram. Here the orchestra is performed under an Ilanyi tree. It welcomes Goddess Paramekava Bhagavadi on her annual visit to Varakam Nada temple.
From the southern Gopuram, the procession from Parame Kava emerges, followed by the one from Thiruvambadi. This is known as Thekotirikam. The latter takes a position on the Gopuram side, while the former is stationed on the opposite end of the Puram ground. The most captivating sight of the Puram is the competition of changing the display of decorative umbrellas. The intricately crafted decorative umbrellas lend the evening its rainbow hues. The night is approaching and the Puram compound is sleepless. The Puram celebrations that begin in the morning continues until the noon of the next day. A bewitching fireworks show marks the grand finale of the Puram and is a fitting tribute to its sublime harmony of sight and sound. The Pagal Puram, a recap of the highlights and hallmarks of Puram Day on the day after. What took place the previous day in enigmatic twilight can now be enjoyed in broad daylight. The goddesses bid adieu and begin the journey back to their abodes. All who bore witness to the festive ceremonies joined together to share a humble ritualistic meal, the Pura Kanyi. The curtain falls and they wait, mortals and immortals alike, for another joyful year and the promise of another sumptuous Puran. <laughs>